All right. Happy Friday, everybody. And it's Oracle back here once again. And The Flash, opening weekend, stumbles at $55 million, uh, for its box office debut. Um, I'm actually looking at some notes here for it. And then over here on comicbookmovies.com. Uh, this movie uh, really flopped. And, you know, really wasn't that great. And, I, and I'm going to tell you what I what I think. We're going to read some of it here. DC's latest superhero, Tent Pole the Flash, earns an underwhelming domestic take at the weekend box office at mid lukewarm critical reception. The Flash's hopes of speeding to a strong premiere weekend domestically were apart after the superhero, Tent Pole. Early returns yield underwhelming results. It's a damn shame. Uh, per deadline, the Flash earned 55 million across North America during the first three days in theaters, while the DC Universe title is expected to reach 64 million. Throughout the holiday weekend, both figures fell short of the projected 70 to 75 million. The Flash was predicted to reel in during its first weekend. Um, you know, I don't know, you know, I'm, my speculation with the, uh, the predictions to predict what it's going to make or what any movie's going to make at, at its weekend uh, debut box office, uh, I think it's kind of goofy, but, uh, you know, for a superhero film, there's a lot of things that are going to be, uh, going behind this film. And I'm going to tell you why. And I, and I think a lot of it has to do with what Ezra Miller did. Uh, I'm not going to read the whole the whole thing here, but ju ju just to make it kind of sh uh, short and sweet, um, I think this movie would have done better if Ezra Miller didn't do what he was doing. I honestly think that it would have been a better film. Uh, I heard that you know the CGI some some of the CGI wasn't that great. Uh, I was going to go see it. I had speculation of going to see it because I wasn't going to support the Ezra Miller at all for what you know he did choked out a female fan and did some other crazy bullshit that he did and uh my opinion i might still go see it. i think it's like a two hour and 34 minute film i might still go and see it just to check it out just to give it a chance you know uh probably not this weekend but uh uh probably next week and i might go ahead and check it out we'll see i mean it, it, it depends um it is a shame you know you, you look at it and like i said the dc the dceu is a whole mess in the first place, I mean, I mean, it's a mess, and you know, I, uh, I have, you know, I don't want to blame James Gunn at all. I'm, I'm very pissed at him still because uh, of, he would not allow a Wonder Woman three to be made with uh, Jenkins and Godot, which I'm still very, very teed off about. But uh, I'll eventually get over that. Um, but at least we got, you know, two films of her, standalone films, and then her and a couple of other other films. But uh, with uh, the whole Ezra Miller thing, I, I strongly believe that the reason why the film didn't do too well is because of the uh, bullshit that he did. The, the attacks on a fan and, you know, a couple of other things that he did. I think that's the reason why it didn't do too well. And, you know, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Uh but I strongly believe that's one of the reasons why the film didn't do too well at the box office uh, during the opening day weekend for the film. But uh, you know, you know, it, it is what it is. You know, it, it is what it is. Uh, I don't like personally. I don't like Ezra Miller. You know, I, I, you know, even before he did what he did, I just, I didn't see him as a great fit for uh, uh, Barry Allen. The Flash. Uh, I strongly believe Grant Gustin was the better Barry Allen in Flash. That's my opinion. I think a lot of people might out there might agree. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. And like I said, I think that's the, re the number one reason as to why it didn't do so great at the box office because of what Ezra Miller did. You know, and uh, it's a damn shame. But uh, let me know what your thoughts is on it. And why did you think it made... Uh, what it should have made. Uh, this is Oracle signing off. Take care.